This is how a spiritual table set with all these type of candle and fruits and wine for blessings and prosperity and riches and also protection. I also I gotta talk about some things we are going with Mobia. Mobia and that judgment, judgment on the land. No, but it's right about no, the body's flagging that it's up again, making work. Yeah, and you say, oh, yeah, see that viewers and subscribers. Bless up on yourself, my people. DND news media and a Sunday morning. But before we start, I just want to give God thanks and you know, a big shout out to all of my supporters. Them now, I'm not supposed to ask some picture or display that is a ritual, that is a table. You know when people saw them and said table and all of that? Yes, this is our table look with all type of candles, all type of juice, all type of fruit, wine. You understand? And it is not a bad thing. Sitting at table is not a bad thing, my people. If you don't have certain knowledge or wisdom or even read or know, know, know certain things, you're going to think, you know, the table is a bad thing or it's evil. No. Your table is a form of thing that you light for prosperity, blessing. All of them can clear have a meaning, right? I'm also going to touch upon some things with Mobia because Mobia under fire, you know. Yeah, man, the devil let loose. But I could talk about the table. Christmas is one of the vivid times where table set and all of that. So as I say, each time you light one of them candles, it have a meaning. You understand? Candles do work. All of them something here. The flowers them. All of them something here have to do with prosperity. The green candle, them a money candle. The yellow candle, you know, a success. Every one of the candles them have a meaning. And you have to have the banana, the melon, all type of fruits. What this do now, it entertain the spirits. It entertains the spirits in a good way. And when you light the candle now, you make your wish and all of that. A lot of people don't believe, but a lot of people know that it works. It do work. And the rich people, them, people are in a society. Even normal people, them, them do them table every now and then. And let me tell you nothing, you have different, different type of tables. You have the goat and cow order with even a table. The goat and cow order is a sacrifice of the goat and the cow. No, I don't want nobody to panic when I hear about sacrifice. The goat and the cow order is not a demonic ritual. It is not of the devil. You understand? Remember back in the days in the Bible when... The, 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 the people them, the wicked people them that got passed through and go out with some things and murder all them for murder. You remember when in the Bible where them say you have to kill the lamb and, and rub the blood over your doorstep? So that's when the enemy come them and go pass over. No, the goat and cow sacrifice is similar. It's an animal, yes, it's similar. And this is an order was set for New Year's Day. And it's an order was set for the whole entire year. So you, if you are under that order, it means that you are fully protected. You are fully protected by the universe. Everything is fully protected. Nobody can harm you. No danger. Because you have people where, even though they have spiritual protection, they set their table every month. Not every month. They set their table every year. You understand? So, the table is a form of protection. And you have money table too. You have prosperity. So, you can set all a table um, for the new year. Where, like I said, 2023 you come here now. You set all a table. You know, so if you right through the year, you have money. Non-stop. These things are very powerful. And if you don't understand, it will confuse into you. If you don't understand my people, it can be very, very confusing. But going to any revival church, and you notice them always set a table, them always have a table. 
revivalism. There's always a table. So, them table they want to see that display as some powerful table. Yeah, man, my people. So, a lot of people do it every year. And as I said to you, if you don't have knowledge and you don't know about this stuff, it's going to be weird to you, it's going to be scary to you. You understand? But, let me tell you know one thing, you know. Is it there help yourself in life or somebody going to tear you down? So you choose. At the end of the day, I always tell my people, you know, just, you just want to say be right with God and you uplift yourself in your life. And if you don't know the truth, you'll get lost. You understand? And the people them where I work over a pound, you know, and I hold them down, you know, I think they give a damn about you. No, they don't give a damn about you. So, at the end of the day, what me would I call it, you have bad obi and you have good obi. If you are trying to uplift yourself with money and prosperity and blessing, me can't see nothing wrong with that because remember, you know, and that what they have to do, you know. Otherwise, one serving God and watch our kids grow and enjoy life. And we need money for enjoy life. So if you can work in science to make money, why not make money? Why not make money? People are working in science, so hold on people and hold on people, pitney and all type of things. You don't think about that. And you don't have to understand what going on. It is not like back in the days where certain things afraid for talk about. I hope I didn't talk at the town right now. Everybody I do it. And that is why I'm kind of scared because it was not a load up thing. It was not a load up thing, you know. Mm-hmm. And enough for everybody neither. It was not a load up thing. If you notice it there in the song, then it, it, it accepted now. It, it 100% accepted. You understand? And I like one time a man I forgot one and look at and I whisper. You get me? I say? It accepted now. And as I say, I will you use it for do. If you use it for do bad, well, you and God are going to talk about it. If you use it for do good and uplift yourself, like set a table where bringing money, wealth, and prosperity, nothing wrong with that. Anyways, I'm going to touch on my mobile here now. There's going to be a prophecy me again, you know. There's going to be a statue, a woman statue, where I got placed on a mobile. In the heart of mobile, I would say in the town where everybody pass and can see. You see, when time that statue drop in a mobile, mighty God, judgment, I don't think you don't say judgment yet, judgment on a mobile. I want people of mobile to listen to me keenly. Go up on your knee, pray to God. Because I want to understand, you know. Mr. Kevin, whatever you want to name, you know. Him set a harder down there, you know. And the harder where him set, you know. The sacrificial harder with man and woman, you know. That harder is still there. But him not dead, him gone. That's God into what they say. Kind of the spiritual realm, him not gone. But anyways... There's going to be a lot of female get missing, dead, all type of things are going to go on. Tongue and mobile. That statue there is going to want a whole heap of blood. Remember, you know. Remember, you know. Come on, I tell you, know. That statue, where they going to put down a mobile, the woman, where they going to put down a mobile, is going to want a whole heap of blood. My beer in trouble. My beer at the place where all the sacrifice are going, all the ritual are going, at the of the human trafficking pass through, at the of enough of the top rank, them we do the cult business. My beer is the harder. My beer set under harder. Why do you think so many scammers they come from my beer? I don't notice that almost the whole of Mobile community full of scammers and all of that. Why is only a handful of them get caught or whatsoever? Yeah, hardly, yes, the scammer get caught down the side. You know. Mobile is one of the richest places in Jamaica, you know, Mobile. And a normal money down in Mobile. You know. But may I tell you, 
all of the money will come from Mobile and a straight money. And me I tell the people, you know, this is a warning, me I tell you, you know, judgment upon the land, judgment for man to go beer. 2023 don't look good. My beer, I go collapse. My beer, I go get it. And also, more of the people them for know next prophecy also. Haiti, Haiti, Cuba, Jamaica, earthquake, earthquake, Ada, earthquake. We are gonna get water, water we are gonna get. But Cuba, Haiti, earthquake. We are gonna get the water. Read between the lines. After earthquake, there's always a little tsunami. Uh, yeah. So it's a tree in one. Haiti gonna get licked. You understand? Cuba will get licked. And of course, Jamaica will get licked. So, remember, 2023 is going to be. It can be good for the people that want it good. But at the end of the day, the Bible will fulfill. Enough look at things are going to happen next year. Next year, the famine is coming. Food shortage. So, all of you are foreign, you now watch this program. Send one, one barrel to your yard to your family. At least two. Who oh, they are yard and nobody are foreign now go and stack up some food. Food shortage coming. 2023. Everybody are going to hold on food. People are going hungry. People are going dead for hungry. Serious, serious warning. Serious, serious warning. People are going hungry. China are going to hold on them food. America are going to hold on them food. Everybody has a whole hand on them food. I remember so Jamaica can produce no food. And you look at four full people them are there. How much ears no people are telling them to plant it on the yard, plant up on a yam, plant up on a dashing, plant up on a pumpkin, plant up on a this, plant up on a that. Well next year I hope on a skin and a teeth. Next year 2023 when the famine come, I hope all of who take this thing for joke. Sit down and skin them teeth because them time down I go know say God real. When you see the famine come at them time down I go know say Bible are fulfilled. When you see the earthquake happen and it's gonna be one of the most biggest earthquake, six point ad me see. When you see all of them things that happen next year, when you see the judgment, I better say no for an go run go in a church, I better say no for an run go baptize. One thing with me, you know, you say anything when me talk, me always come see it manifest, you know. Me always come see it at me, you know. So, it is not a proving point or nothing. Me just I want the people them. And when I want the people them, me just I go sit down and relax and watch everything manifest. And only somebody me always sorry for in this life. And the little kids them when I know better. But big people who know better, I can't feel sorry for them because if you listen to my program, you know what's going on. I'm going to tell you what's going on. And you make judgment reach you. Something wrong with your brother. Everybody who listen to this program, bless you. Know. May I show you a show now thing? There's an order on this channel where in some form of way you get a breakthrough. If me even a work with you, are you not decide for work with me? You get some form of breakthrough. Something good happening in your life. And me soon start to back some live show and make people come to them testimony. I show my plate full with wall heap of work and all type of things. Me soon come to back some live show. Everybody who watch my program get help. Everybody who watch my program get result. Everybody will watch my program get blessed and get blessings in some form of way. So people, as when I saw the Mobia order, you know, watch on yourself. The people of Mobia, watch on yourself. About four or five pitney. Me I watch all going in now. I watch you hear me not say nothing now. About, about six pitney miss me now, you know. Remember me telling about the Christmas season. Remember me telling about what I go on in the sacrificial world. 
A six feet name is now. I will say no more. Bless upon yourself. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe.